it's good to see you doing so well. I know you can't turn your head, but you've got a great view. Oh, are you okay? Marge, he's got nine lives. I am a Hindu, sir, not a cat. I have infinite lives, during some of which I may be a cat. In those, I do have nine. A poo, face it. Our store is ruined. This is painful, but I no longer want the customers to come again. I want to work somewhere else. I see. Nurse, transfer this man to the mental ward. Okay. Listen to me. When I was hit with a sign, that was a sign. I'm through. How can you abandon me, brother? Well, the way we abandoned our other brother. What other brother? All I remember on that boat was you, the tiger, and the wise old fox. The oh my God! The fox was actually Tiku. Oh, sweet little Tiku! I blocked out the memory. Oh no, Tiku! <laughs> yes, well, I have given my share of the store to my son Jamshed. He will rebuild while you recuperate. Little Jamshed, how he's grown! Indeed, first in his class with a business degree from Wharton, and he is ready to take my place, degunking the cheese warmer. All right, my brother. I will especially miss looking into your tired, sunken eyes during our wordless shift changes. Hmm. Remember when we used to nod? I do. I do. Hanad, <laughs> wait till you see my art therapy. You're gonna love it too. Please try to pretend I'm not here. Okay, Stephen. <laughs> hey, where did it go? Best marriage counseling ever. But we still need to discuss your addiction to unboxing videos. Do not make me choose between you and unboxing. Banga! Kore wa tashi no debug dana to isha ne ekere shiteru zo masi doru kana. And with that seal cut, we have completed the unboxing of the outer shipping plastic. Indeed, we have. You published my private art therapy as a comic book? Um, actually, it's a graphic novel. The distinctions are threefold. Shut up. Okay then. Um, in my defense, my wife did it. Kamiko, how could you? I have acted shamefully. I must commit furry cosplay. <laughs> oh. There's nothing sexy about shame, except in my native Japan, where it's our whole thing. Mr. and Mrs. Bukai, you had no right to do this. These are my daughter's feelings and my doodles. I shall burn them on a pyre and disperse them to the seven winds. That's all I ask. Huh? One sad girl, please. Sad girl's the best. It's tragically delicious. Wait. Maybe this isn't so bad. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> My Lulu's! Are you Terry Bradshaw? No, it's uh Donny Osmond. Boner, Boner from Growing Pains. You're all wrong. My real identity is Flavor Flav. I think so many of us have made a god that's like us instead of the other way around. God loves diversity. God didn't just make one type of flower. He made thousands of different flowers. Roses, lilies, orchids. And he made the weeds too. But he loves all of them indiscriminately. Just like the bees. You have made this bumblebee a humblebee. When you tell people that you believe in God, usually they take that to mean that you're quietly judging their lifestyle. Or think everybody but you is going to hell. Way to preach, bitch. I'm going to pretend I heard amen. Oh, relax, bitch. Oh. <laughs> ah, Chief, this guy still had ten minutes on his meter. Just when I understood that guy, when I believed again, when I believed in people, they took him away. I've lost my faith, Lou. Come on, Chief, you got a beautiful wife and kid. I can't, I'm sorry, I can't say that with a straight face. Well, you could try. <laughs> I am, I I'm trying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm even try again. You got a beautiful wife. <clears throat> Good evening. The more I spend time with dogs, the more I realize that I entirely prefer them to people. <laughs> no, no, I'm serious. I really despise you. <gasps> despise us? I, hey, as the owner of a dog, a tiger, and a dolphin, I am highly offended. Highly. Okay, first of all, I hate that you call yourselves owners. You own living beings? <laughs> nice. 
Uh, hello? Clayton, I can't talk right now. I've left her. I have left my wife. What? Really? You and I have loved each other since primary school. She knew that, so I think she was relieved. Oh, Clay, I'd stopped allowing myself to hope. But, uh, I think I gotta call you right back. No, no, stay on the call, we're invested. I have to go. I'm giving a lecture. Wait, wait, we're getting married, right? Yeah, sure, sure, yeah, whatever. Wait! Oh, yes. You don't deserve dogs. They sniff out your diseases and comfort you when you ride planes. And I constantly hear, how do I get my dog to listen? Choke him till he taps out! Oh, good God. Always, what can your dog do for you? Never once has somebody asked, what is my dog trying to say? Bad, bad, all of you, bad. This was the worst extension class I ever took, my God. It was even worse than flower arranging. I mean, who can say where baby's breath should go? <laughs> Not I, I'll tell you that much. Abraham Simpson, as you have pled guilty to the murder of Vivian St. Charmaine, I'm giving you life in prison, and I'm giving your podcast five stars, but no comment. Who has the time? You guys talking sports stories? You know, I won a bronze medal in the 84 Olympics. Are you serious? Track and field. It's a pretty good story. It's a series of coincidences that if someone wrote, no one would believe. Oh my God, why is there only half a medal? How much time you got? We got about seven minutes and I haven't gone yet. Rocky, 